Dr. Juliet and we are here together again today to talk about A to Z dog health care and today we're talking about how to do it how can I socialize my puppy how can I socialize even my dog but if you talk about socializing I always talk about this crucial six first months with your puppy as soon as your puppy is weaned off his mommy and you get your puppy at the right age at two months then you have to start socializing your puppy because those first six months are crucial you have to do whatever and as much as you can with that little little being and that little teddy bear is not as weak or how do you say has to be pampered as you think that little puppy if it if it is weaned off correctly at eight weeks then you can just take it wherever you want you can let it walk with his feet you don't have to carry it you can let it walk on the sand in the mud in the rain you take it everywhere with you where you can you take it to a temple festival let it hear the crackers of Diwali you know whatever get it with older people get it with people who are afraid the puppy has to know that you're there for him but that you don't overprotect him because when he socialized the first six months then he will be a great dog later on he won't be afraid he will know what is thunder he will know what is rain and don't be afraid you don't have to wait until full immunization is there like most people don't take their dog out at all so it's really important after basic vaccination most of the time when the puppy is three months old you can take him with you in the car already um, to most of the time to play with other kids and if you have a great community around you well why not installing puppy encounters uh, get together with other dogs get together with dogs that you know that are good with with other dogs it's a really really crucial time often forgotten and behavior is one of the we'll talk about it later, is, is one of the uh, triggers also to disease. And a dog has to be comfortable in any situation. So just don't see your puppy as a little, little thing that you have to overprotect. They're really strong and they can go everywhere. But if you don't make them, if you don't get them used to noise, to, to different people, then you won't get a lot. One nice story about socializing is actually socializing my own old puppy dog who is now getting 14 years old. When my husband and I got our first house together, the first house we rented together as a couple, um, I always promised that my husband could choose the dog he wanted. And as we were in Belgium, my husband fell in love with Border Collies. So we went to the farm and we chose a puppy and we chose a puppy and we made a mistake. So mistakes, out of mistakes we can learn because this puppy was already three months, nearly three months and a half old and he hasn't been socialized. He was staying in the barn behind the, the how do you say, behind the back of the cows and he was very scared. He didn't even come to us. So we still took that puppy home. I couldn't get him out of the corner in the house for like two weeks. We had to feed him so he would come to us. So if we would have continued just accepting this, it would have been very difficult with Eli. But we spent time with him, we took him with us, we spent some time in the car, two minutes first and then three minutes. We took him out in the street on the leash where he would be jumping very scared when he would hear a noise of a truck. So that all that time so up to his six months and even longer on we did everything with him and since then Ely goes everywhere with us and we can take him everywhere in the back of the car in the forest two parties everybody can pet him and he, even he was the biggest biggest how do you say um, guinea pig for our students even whenever he was we could uh, learn students to inject put needles in him he is a dog I can do everything with him but I believe that was because we spent crucial time with him socializing and he had already a difficult start so it was even more difficult with the puppy that hasn't been socialized at, that that we had a little bit too late it's better not to have the puppy too late but neither too early neither so start from his two months up to yeah the rest of his life but do that so this was today's video about how to socialize a puppy and also even a more uh, adult dog don't forget to subscribe to my channel 
Dr. Juliet de Kastecker, and see you soon tomorrow again for a new video. Thank you.